this month's TV 47 Star Student of the Month. All right, I got a beautiful young lady here. She is our Star Student of the Month, and her name is Ashton Bishop. Bishop. Morning, Ashton. Morning. How are you this morning? I'm good. How a are little you? early, but uh, we're going to get it in, right? Yes, sir. And you go to Mumford Middle School? Yes, sir. What do you like about Mumford Middle School? I like all the teachers and how they're encouraging and support everybody's decisions and what they want to do. You enjoy school? Sometimes. <laughs> yeah. Just maybe getting up too early every morning? Yes, sir. Sometimes I always wonder why we didn't start school about 10 o'clock, but mm -hmm. then we'd have to be there tonight and you'd say, we got school too long. So uh, let me see. You, who's your parents? My parents are Angela and Jason Bishop. Okay. Uh, great folks. <laughs> they are. They're good. And you've got one brother. What's his name? His name is Briar Bishop. Briar Bishop. What grade is Briar in? He's graduated. He's 20. Oh, he's already out and about, huh? Yes, sir. He working? Yes, sir, he does. Good, good, good. And uh, dogs? I got two dogs. What's their names? Uh, I got a miniature poodle. Her name's Quinn. And then I got a German Shepherd. Her name's Nova. Which one's your favorite? The miniature poodle. He stays in your bed all the time, don't it? I wish. <laughs> That's not a mama's dog, is it? It is. <laughs> it stays with mama's lap all the mm -hmm. time. Well, that's the way it goes most of the time. And uh, what's some of your favorite things to do at Mumford? Um, I like playing sports. Okay. And uh, uh, the encouragement and positive attitude from administration and the coaches? Mm-hmm. Who is some of your coaches? Y'all say you're a three-sport athlete. Um, some of my coaches is Destiny Brisky. And she is the... She's my volleyball and basketball coach. Oh, she's both coaches, huh? Yes, sir. Yeah. And then my softball coach is Daryl Smith. Okay. And, uh, uh, this is kind of a tricky question, but which one of those sports do you like the most? I'm not sure, honestly. It's, it's you close. You like all three of them? Yes, sir, I do. Well, that's great. That's great. And, uh, you had, uh, you had some special things going on during volleyball, right? Yes, sir, I did. It was, it was a lot. It was fun. What about, uh, I see, what, wasn't you on the all-tournament team? Yes, sir, I did. I made an all-tournament team for the county tournament. You must be pretty good. I'm okay. <laughs> You're okay? Yeah. Well, to make that tournament team, you must be real good. <laughs> Okay, that was the Tallahassee County Tournament, mm -hmm. right? And, uh, but you also was the MVP for Area 8. Yes, sir, I was. I think you're a lot better than what you're trying to put now. <laughs> um, is, uh, you have maintained, right, good grades? Yes, sir, I have. Right, I've had A's and B's. Well, that's, that's real good. And, um, you're also involved in the FBLA? Yes, sir, I am. Could you speak on that for a minute? Um, in FBLA, it's an opportunity for us to like get a bunch of people skills in. Uh -huh. We get to help others and just show what leadership is. When like we go to the elementary school, help out with the little kids and go on field trips and do fun stuff like that. Uh, life lessons. Those are all good points that you just made because all those things that you just said will carry you all the way through life. Mm, yes, so sir. it's great that you're in there and you're learning these skills at an early age. Because, uh, you know, uh, maybe not yet, but in the future, and probably already are, there's a lot of little kids looking up to you. Yes, sir. I and they so. watch every move you make, so you have to be a good girl. Mm hmm. Yes, sir. But that's a good thing, isn't it? Mm, yes, sir. It okay. Is. Now, uh, uh, do you eat school at lunch? I mean, eat lunch at school? Do I eat lunch at school? Mm -hmm. Sometimes. So, sometimes you carry it, sometimes you mm -hmm. eat. If you do eat at school, what's your favorite food? Um, 
probably just the chicken, chicken nuggets. Yeah, I like chicken nuggets too. <laughs> uh, now, uh, you got a bunch of, who's your favorite teacher? Uh, my favorite teacher is probably Coach Young. Okay. He's our history teacher and he just makes it fun all while learning still. Right. Is it, is, uh, now, what does he coach? He coaches football and basketball. Oh, he does basketball too? Yes, sir. Okay. Well, he's busy all year too, isn't he? Yes, sir, he is. But he's, uh, he explains history real good. Yes, sir, he does. I, I love history. History and math is my favorite subjects. You <laughs> like math? Math's okay. It's a little complicated. Well, uh, if you hadn't already told, I'm going to tell you something about math. You need to learn as much math as you can because starting from day one, after you turn 16 or when you get out of high school, we use math every day. If you don't know how to count your money, you're not going to have any, right? <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> okay. How about some friends? I bet you got a lot of friends at school. Yeah, some of my closest friends are Riley Ricks, uh, Lauren Brewster. We're pretty, we're pretty tight. Okay. Uh, are these, uh, do those girls play sports with you? Lauren does. Okay. What does she play? She plays basketball, volleyball, and she runs track. Okay. Uh, what's your future goals? I mean, do you, uh, do you have a, go ahead and tell us your future goals. My plan is to get a full ride scholarship um, for some type of sport. I don't know mm -hmm. which one yet, but, and major in um, social working, mm -hmm. become a social worker. You like, uh, well, you seem like you got good people skills. Yes, sir. Um, do you have your backup plan? No, I really don't know yet. You better get getting your backup plan. Yes, sir, I'm working on it. Because uh, the social worker can be done with or without a scholarship, but make sure you got a backup plan and don't be disappointed if you don't get a scholarship. Still make plans with stuff to still be social worker sounds like you want to do, mm -hmm. but uh, have you a backup plan in case the sports thing don't work out, okay? Yes, sir. And uh, how about your grandparents? Let's go ahead, let's go ahead and mention them. Uh, my grandparents are Sandra and Dole Davis, and then Darlene and Russell Bishop. Okay. Uh, this is Mr. Aston Bishop, and I want you to look right there in that camera and wave to all your friends and your favorite teachers. And she is our star student of the month. Thank you. Thank you.